So my name is Joan Keegan and I teach marketing over in TU Dublin City Campus in Ainger Street. So I teach on a number of Level 8 programmes. We have a BBS degree and we have a degree in Retail and Services Management. I teach on some of the Level 6 programmes as well, but um, mostly the Level 8 programmes. And I've been running um, student learning with community programmes on my marketing courses for the last four to five years. Um, I started out running these, uh, this initiative really to try and engage students more and to um, provide a better sort of um, experience for students who are in second year on a marketing programme. It gives the students an opportunity to work with a real live organisation and in some respects the students get an opportunity almost to work as a marketing consultant. They get to go and visit the social enterprise, they go get an opportunity really to look at what their needs are and to be creative in developing a marketing solution for addressing those needs. So it, it's a lovely opportunity for the students to have that sort of access to a real life business. Um, it's also very, very important work that we're doing is it gives social enterprises an opportunity to tap into all of the skills that are available across TU Dublin. Um, so we're just one tiny little aspect of that and we're operating in the world of marketing. Um, and, and it's lovely that we're teaching this stuff in the classroom and it gives the students a chance then to add value ideally to a social enterprise that's probably struggling in that particular area. So it, it's, there's a number of sort of phases in, in putting it kind of all together. Uh, phase one really is where I meet with the, the team from the Students Learning with Communities Division. They come in usually in September and introduce the social enterprises that they have on their database at that stage. And we usually find about three or four that are a good fit for the students. And what I'm looking for is a business that would really benefit from a marketing plan. Um, so once those businesses are picked, um, the business comes in and meets with me and we go through really what would be delivered by the students and also the businesses would outline really what their needs are as well. So that's sort of phase one. Uh, phase two, the businesses then that we have agreed to participate will come in and they will do a presentation to the students about the social enterprise, really what its remit is and really what their marketing problem is and, and what they're hoping to achieve out of it. So that's kind of an important stage in the process. Um, the students are then allocated a social enterprise, they work in teams, groups of four usually. Um, and then midway through, usually around mid-October, the students will go on a site visit then to the social enterprise. Um, so they have done some preliminary research at this stage, so they go out almost really as consultants. They go out to see the business in its daily operations, they get to ask questions, um, meet the, the, the wider team and all of that. Um, and then they come back in and they complete the marketing plan over the next four or five weeks. And the last phase, which I'm currently working on at the moment, is really where the students will present the marketing plans then to the social enterprises. So they will come back into our uh, Angel Street um, campus and the students will do a formal presentation about the plan. So that's a very exciting time for us and we're going through that at the moment and uh, enjoying it hugely. Um, I suppose I would always sort of stress to the students that this is really a chance for them really to put their academic knowledge into practice and it's almost an opportunity to work as a marketing consultant while they're still in college. So that's a very, very exciting opportunity for the students. Probably the best thing about all of this is that the students really get to work with a real life business. There's no um, information held back, all of the information is available. You know, in the past we would have done marketing plans for big kind of multinational companies and you're relying on the internet to get data. This is a fantastic opportunity where the students get to meet the, own, the, the manager, um, the service users, the, the, the customers, uh, and really get to, to study the business from every aspect um, and then see what added value they can bring to it. Um, I think really how engaged students will get with it because they really feel there's a responsibility here. Um, we have another social enterprise in at the moment and they have a very clear goal, they're short of 5,000 euros every month and they need a marketing plan that's going to help address that shortfall and you can't get any more sort of hands-on than that. So they really have an autonomy around their, their project and they're very, very engaged in it. I suppose you're working in a more facilitative role with the students and that's working very, very well. Um, 
it, it, you, you relook at your assessment sort of approach as well. So I suppose it's more drilling down all of the time into the assessment, so we're getting more out of it. Um, and I'm learning all the time as well. Um, it's been very, very good for me in terms of really um, just uh, developing closer relationships, working relationships with the students and really looking at assessment in a much more sort of formative way because there's three people here, there's the students, there's me and there's the social enterprise and we really all want to get something out of this. I suppose there's a little bit of stress at the beginning because it all really needs to work. We're on a 12 week semester so it is, it's a very tight schedule. Um, and I am always probably a little bit stressed in September um, because it all needs to get diary scheduled and it all needs to run. Um, so while I'm stressed about that, it's never not run. You know, there's just such a, a fantastic, it's been a fantastic experience. You know, it is one of the strategic sort of goals of TU Dublin to develop closer relationships with community partners. And, uh, you know, the government itself has just launched a social enterprise strategy. This really is a huge facet of business going forward in the future.